hello friends welcome to my channel today in this video we are going to make a rainbow colored square pattern which can be used for making blankets baby blankets for table cover table runner and even for door mats as well the techniques that i have applied in making this project are chains single crochet and double crochet so it is a very good tutorial for those who want to learn all these basic stitches so we are going to begin now we need yarn of 7 colors for this project as we are going to make rainbow pattern so you can check the colors that I am going to use a pair of scissors to use as and when required and a hook that could match to the thickness of the yarn so let's get started at first we have to pick up the tail of the yarn of color A make a loop insert the hook in pull through to make a slip knot now yarn over pull through pull through pull through and pull through these are four chains we have to go back to the fourth chain insert the hook in yarn over pull through the two loops on the hook pull through both the loops this is slip stitch now foundation ring is ready we have to make chain one two three which counts as a double crochet yarn over insert the hook into the ring pull through pull through two pull through two this is double crochet two not double crochet three chain two for chain space now we have to make three double crochet double crochet one two and three for the next side of the square chain two for chain space three double crochet again one two and three chain two for chain space now double crochet one two and three so these are four sides of the square now we have to make chain two for the next corner of the square now join the stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch now we have to cut the yarn from here because we are going to add next color to the pattern to join next color take the tail of the yarn make a loop insert the hook in pull through to make a slip knot now we have to join the yarn into the chain space of two so insert the hook in pull through pull through two now we have to make chain one two three which counts as a double crochet into the same chain space of two one more double crochet on the top of next three stitches we have to make one double crochet on the top of each so double crochet one two and three into this chain space of two for the corner of the square we have to make double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two on the top of next three stitches we have to make one double crochet on the top of each so double crochet one two and three into this chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space two more double crochet one two for the corner of the square now on the top of next three stitches we have to make three double crochet on the top of each so double crochet one two and three on the top of third double crochet now into this chain space of two we have to make double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space 
into the same chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two on the top of double crochet double crochet one on the top of the next stitch one double crochet on the top of the next stitch one double crochet now into this chain space of two where we have made two double crochet we have to make two more one two chain two for chain space now we have to join the stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch now we are going to add next color to the pattern to add next color take the tail of the yarn make a loop insert the hook in pull through to make a slip knot now we have to join the yarn into the chain space of two so insert the hook in pull through pull through two chain one two three which counts as a double crochet into the same chain space of two one more double crochet now on the top of next seven stitches we have to make one double crochet on the top of each so double crochet one two on the top of the next stitch three on the top of the next stitch four five six and seven into the chain space of two double crochet one and double crochet two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two now on the top of seven stitches of the previous round we have to make seven stitches into this chain space of two for the corner of the square we have to make two double crochet chain two and two double crochet so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when this round is complete we have to make two double crochet into the chain space of two so double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space now we have to join the stitches on the top of the fourth stitch so insert the hook and pull through pull through two this round is complete now we are going to add next color to the pattern to add next color take the tail of the yarn make a loop insert the hook in pull through to make a slip knot now we have to join the yarn into the chain space of two so insert the hook in pull through pull through two now we have to make chain one two three which counts as a double crochet into the same chain space of two one more double crochet now on the top of all these stitches we have to make one double crochet so double crochet one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven now into this chain space of two we have to make double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of two for the corner of the square we have to make two more double crochet so complete the round following the same pattern we have to make one double crochet on the top of each stitch for all the sides of the square but for the corner of the square we have to make two double crochet chain two two double crochet so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when this round is complete we have made two double crochet chain two for the corner of the square now we are going to join these stitches on the top of the first double crochet with single crochet now we have to cut the yarn from here because we are going to add next color to the pattern to add next color take the tail of the yarn make a loop insert the hook in pull through to make a slip knot now we have to join the yarn into the chain space of two with 
slip stitch now we have to make chain one two three which counts as a double crochet into the chain space of two one more double crochet on the top of each stitch of the previous round we have to make one double crochet so double crochet one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen into the chain space of two double crochet one double crochet two chain two for chain space and two more double crochet for the corner of the square so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when this round is complete we have made two double crochet into the first corner of the square where we began the pattern now chain two for chain space join the stitches on the top of the four stitch with slip stitch now we have to cut the yarn from here because we are going to add next color to the pattern to add next color take the tail of the yarn make a loop insert the hook in pull through to make a slip knot now we have to join the yarn into the chain space of two so insert the hook in pull through pull through two chain one two three which counts as a double crochet into the chain space of two one more double crochet now on the top of all the stitches of the previous round of this side of the square we have to make one double crochet and for the corner of the square we have to make two double crochet chain two and two double crochet so we have made five double crochet now this is the sixth one seventh eighth ninth tenth eleventh twelfth thirteenth fourteenth fifteenth sixteenth seventeenth eighteenth nineteenth now two double crochet into the chain space of two chain two for chain space into the same chain space of two two more double crochet so complete the round following the same pattern and we will meet again when this round would be completed when this round is complete we have to make chain two now we have to join the stitches on the top of the four stitch so insert the hook in pull through pull through two now we have to cut the yarn from here because we are going to add next color to the pattern to add next color take the tail of the yarn make a loop insert the hook in pull through to make a slip knot now we have to join the yarn into the chain space of two with single crochet chain one two three which counts as a double crochet into the chain space of two one more double crochet we have to make one double crochet on the top of each so double crochet one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 
थर्टीन फोर्टीन फिफ्टीन सिक्सटीन सेवेंटीन एटीन नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन ट्वेंटी टू ट्वेंटी थ्री एंड टू डबल क्रॉशे इन टू द चेन स्पेस ऑफ टू फॉर द कॉर्नर ऑफ द स्क्वायर चेन टू फॉर चेन स्पेस इन टू द सेम चेन स्पेस ऑफ टू टू मोर डबल क्रॉशे सो कम्प्लीट द राउंड फॉलोइंग द सेम पैटर्न एंड वी विल मीट अगैन वेन दिस राउंड वुड बी कम्प्लीट वेन दिस राउंड इज कम्प्लीट वी हैव टू मेक चेन टू नाउ वी हैव टू जॉइन द स्टिचेज ऑन द टॉप ऑफ द फोर स्टिच सो इंसर्ट द हुक इन पुल थ्रू पुल थ्रू टू नव दिस द स्क्वायर पैटर्न इज कम्प्लीट दिस स्क्वायर कैन बी यूज फॉर मेकिंग ब्लैंकेट्स बेबी ब्लैंकेट्स फॉर टेबल कवर टेबल रनर एंड फॉर डोर मैट्स एज वेल यू कैन मेक एज मनी एज स्क्वायर्स यू नीड फॉर द प्रोजेक्ट और यू कैन चेंज द सीक्वेंस ऑफ द कलर आई मीन टू से यू कैन यूज ईच कलर थ्री टाइम्स टू मेक द स्क्वायर बिगर फॉर द पर्पज ऑफ मेकिंग ब्लैंकेट्स और फॉर टेबल कवर और टेबल मैथ्स और इवन फॉर बेड कवर थैंक यू सो मच